What's up, math scholars and math haters? This is Mr. W. Today we're going to tackle question 10 in the 8th grade math questions that North Carolina released this past school year. We can see that we're just being asked to tell in which choice all three points, so every choice has three points, and we're supposed to see in which answer choice they all go on the same straight line. To do a question like this, when you see it on a test, the easiest way to do a question like this is to graph your points. And you should have graph paper. Um, it'll be a little trouble to actually make the graph, but if you can get good at that under pressure, then you can do questions like this no problem. So I'm actually going to do that, and I'm going to use a little bit of editing magic to um, bring up my graphing whiteboard. So this is the whiteboard that I'm going to use for my graphing. And I'm going to go ahead and just graph each set of points in one of my answer choices. So to start with choice A, I have the point 0, 1. So essentially, that's just one up from the origin where these two lines meet, and that's right there. Probably shouldn't have written that in red. Let me use blue. So that's 0, 1. Next point is negative 1 and 3, so that's left 1 and up 3. And next point is positive 1 and 3, so that's right 1 and up 3. So between this point, this point, and this point, which I had to write as a circle, that's not a straight line. So I know that choice A can't be my answer. The magic of editing will make this stuff disappear. And now we're ready for choice B. My three points are 4, 2, 2, 1, and 4, negative 2. So I'll start by graphing positive 4, positive 2, which puts me here. Positive 2, positive 1 puts me there. And now positive 4, negative 2 actually puts me here. I run into the same problem. My three points are not on the same straight line, so I know that choice B can't be it. Now I'm ready to test out choice C, where my points are 0, 0, so right here on the origin. 8, 0, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 0, that's there. And then 0, 8, that means I go left or right 0 and up 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And that's here. So point, point, and point, those are definitely not on the same straight line. For choice D, my th three points are 1, 2, 2, 4, and 4, 8. So let's go ahead and graph those. x of 1, y of 2 is right there. x of 2, y of 4 is right here. x of 4, y of 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 is here. Now, of course, I'm not the best artist. I wasn't when I made this thing, and I wasn't when I drew the points, but this looks like a pretty promising line. Of all the choices, choice D is the only one whose points all lie on the straight line. So let me just go ahead, zoom in, circle choice D. Our answer is D.